Hello friends, today we'll be reading Noah's Ark. Make sure you subscribe. After Adam and Eve left the garden, many people were born. The people kept doing bad things, and they forgot about God. Except Noah. Noah loved God. God was sad that everyone but Noah forgot about him. He told Noah about his plan to start over. Make yourself an ark. God said, here's how. So Noah and his family began working on the ark. When it was done, God said, take your family and two of every animal in the ark. Animals creeped, crawled, hopped, and galloped onto Noah's new boat. After everyone was inside, the rain begun to fall and fall and fall. The ark rocked this way and that way on the rising water. Finally, the rain stopped. Water covered everything. Everyone inside the ark was safe. Noah and his family were very happy. One day, Noah sent a dove to find land. It flew and flew but never found any, so it came back. One week later, Noah sent the dove out again. This time, it brought him an olive leaf. Noah cheered. It must have found land. The ark finally came to a rest on top of a mountain. God told Noah to leave the ark. Noah and his family praised God. God put a beautiful rainbow in the sky. It was a sign of his promise to never flood the whole earth again. The Tall Tower After the flood, everyone spoke the same language. One word meant hello, one word meant mom, and one word meant dad. The people said, if we work together, we can do anything. Let's build a tower that goes all the way up to heaven. Then everyone will see how great we are. The people worked on their tower. They built it taller and taller. They began to brag. God did not like the way they were acting. It was as if they no longer needed him. So God mixed up their language. When they tried to talk to each other, it sounded like babble. Everyone was confused. Then God scattered the people all over the earth. They had to stop building their tower. From then on, the tower was called Babel. Okay, friends, that's all for now. Make sure you subscribe. We have more stories to read and more stories to learn. Remember, reading is fundamental. So think smart and read.